Well, I'm here with Emmy winner Trevor Morris, who's one of my favorite composers. Nice to see you, Trevor. How are you doing tonight? I'm very well. Good to see you, too. So, you're at the BMI Awards, and I just overheard this, uh, you're talking to John, that's your first year with BMI. So, what does the organization of BMI mean to you as a composer working in this industry? You know, I think an important part of being a composer, because we're in dark rooms a lot, is the community that you're with. And, uh, you know, being at BMI, and it's my first time here, I'm really feeling the sense of community to be with my peers and my friends. And uh, it feels at home. I'm really happy to be here. And you just wrapped on Vikings, but a new season's coming on its way. So, uh, how has the show evolved and how has your score changed uh, throughout these, uh, was it three seasons now? Yeah, season three is starting up. The score has really evolved a lot, actually. More than any other show I've ever done, it's really found new depths and, and ethnicity. I'm really happy and proud of season two, and I'm actually already writing season three in my head and figuring out how to not reinvent it so much as freshen it up and find a new way to do things. So, it's, it's a great gig, it's a great project. And I know you mentioned to me on our last interview that you're you're about to go over to Europe to research your next film, is that correct? That's right, I'm going over to Amsterdam to, to uh, research a small indie movie called, well not small by Holland standards, small, right. called Mikael de Ruiter, who's a famous boat captain from the 1700s. It's kind of like Master Commander of the Far Side of the World. So I'm going to go over there, go on set, hang with the director who's a friend, observe the culture, you know, like see the city, that kind of stuff. Right, right. It's kind of rare to have like three or four months lead time before you have to start writing queue. so I'm really looking forward to that. You just said Brick Mansions, and that was a, a really uh, rush job almost, right? Brick Mansions was the polar opposite. That was <laughs> enormous time pressure. And you know what? Those scores have an energy to them as well because you do right. it in that manner. This is the other way where it's think about it and research it and sketch out some ideas, and I'm, I'm, I'm really looking forward to taking my time on it. <laughs> well, Trevor, thank you so much. It's so great to talk to you again, and uh, enjoy the night. Thanks. My pleasure.